Dead Eye, the Council is pleased to see you've arrived on Alderaan. Until recently, Alderaan was a part of the Republic. Today, it's on the brink of collapse. Shortly after seceding, both the Queen and the heir to the Alderaanian throne were assassinated. A usurper, Boris Olgo, stepped into power, setting off a civil war. Spare me the history lesson. Just tell me who I'm supposed to find. Master Sidoni Garen, one of the Jedi Order's finest strategists and diplomats, dropped out of contact briefly while on Alderaan. She's made contact since, but was evasive about her silence. Master Sidoni is brokering a peace on Alderaan. If she is suffering from the plague, it could jeopardize the entire peace process. Why must I always be the one to fix these things? You are the only one with the ability to shield the Plague Master's victims. Master Sidoni was working with the head of House Organa's diplomatic corps, Hala Morgana. Find Master Sidoni and make sure she is well, that the peace process is not in jeopardy. Welcome, Jedi. I'm Hala Morgana, head of House Organa's diplomatic corps, and this is my younger, more handsome brother, Lou. Please, Hala. You do yourself an injustice. Your age gives you a stately difference. If I wasn't wearing my extra years around my waist, I might agree. Now, Jedi, how can I help you? I was told that you could put me in touch with Master Sidoni Garin. Ah, yes. Master Sidoni truly remarkable woman. Well, you just missed her. She's at the Peace Summit. A Peace Summit on Alderaan. <laughs> Imagine that. But I'll call her. The location of the summit is a secret for obvious reasons. But I'm sure she'd welcome your assistance. Hello, Organa. I'm sorry, but I'm very busy right now. The summit is just getting underway. I was hoping I could join you. You're Master Yuan, student, aren't you? It's wonderful the Council sent you to assist me, but this is a very delicate process, with no place for a Padawan. I passed my trials, and I think the Council knows what it's doing. Only official representatives of the Houses may attend the summit. What would the other Houses think if another Jedi from House Wagana showed up? And I don't have time to debate, if you'll excuse me. Master Sidoni, uh, oh, I'm, I'm sorry, Jedi. That's really not like her. Don't apologize. Get me into that summit. Yes, right, of course. Master Sidoni said that only representatives can go to the summit. Unfortunately, Organa's representative is already there. How? House Tyrol. You know, with the beautiful daughter. Couldn't our Jedi friend represent them? Ha! Huh, my brother is a genius. House Tyrol is desperate for a representative, but the usurper Ulgo destroyed their hopes. If you could help them defend themselves against their enemies and return them to glory, I'm sure they'd make you their delegate. Why would I want to represent such a worthless house? It's true, House Tyrol isn't much now, but their lineage is noble. You'll find Lord Tyrol in his house's last holdings, an enclave near Ulgo Lands and Killick Nests. I will let them know you're coming. And beware the Killicks. Those insect men have terrible tempers. Chino hagua bunta cho, chubalong haku, ya sa un kubas, taja bakta tun bunko. I have more pressing issues at hand. Wanta humpa, muri rava fupa, jibampa wula, a king saliki kava dumpa stupa. I will destroy them all.
Are you Lord Terrell? I'm here to become your delegate to the Peace Summit. Jedi, yes. Uh, Organa told me you'd be coming, but, well, this is... Uh, well, it's complicated. The whole house needs to approve a new delegate, and, well, they, they, they say they won't approve a stranger. She may be a stranger, but she's a Jedi. I should think you'd be grateful for her assistance. Yes, of course, but House Terral has fallen so hard, we don't even have the strength to hope. It will take more than my word to convince them. In other words, you're all too full of self-pity to help yourselves. It wasn't always this way, Jedi. But then our original delegate was killed, and Ulgo drove us back to this hole. I'm sorry, you're right. As my daughter Fasha says, no good can come of self-pity. Just tell the Jedi our plan, Father. Right. House Terral's current position is precarious. Our enemy, House Ulgo, seeks our destruction. Their army is at our gate. House Terral needs a strong ally if we are to survive. We need Haas Organa. What would be involved? We proposed a marriage alliance to House Organa. My daughter Fasha would marry Lu Organa. But House Terral is weak, and powers within Organa. Fear we'd drag them down with us. We need to prove to Organa that House Terral can defend itself against its enemies. I will destroy them all. Jedi, it's your diplomatic skills that we need right now. As I've said, House Ulgo's forces are at our gates, threatening to drive us out of our last holding. But Ulgo's commanding general, Astar Vox, is a mercenary with a loose definition of loyalty. If we can reach him, turn him, we can break the siege. This approach seems overly complicated. Can I use my lightsaber instead? Killing him would break the siege, but my hope is that Astar Vox can help House Terral build up its armies. If he won't be bought, by all means kill him. But if you can bring him to our side, House Terral's security will be the better for it. I will do whatever gets the job done fastest. We have no time to waste. I will contact House Organa the moment I hear that the siege is broken. I've come representing House Terrell. They want you to give up this siege and join them. Well, isn't this a surprise? The Jedi have decided to involve themselves in Alderanian politics. You must be pretty sure of yourself to walk into a room of highly trained commandos. But you should know that I don't do business with just anyone. Then I'll have to use violence. Oh, come on, Jedi. I didn't mean that. The battlefield is the only true test of a person's worth. War, bloodshed, these are the fires and forges of greatness. I only negotiate with my equals. Besides, my men are itching for sport. Best a pack of my warhounds have no talk. I don't have time to waste. Jedi, thank goodness I've reached you. There's good news and bad news. The good news is everyone's heard how you killed Asta Vox and broke the siege, including Organa. They've agreed to the marriage alliance. Now the bad news. Lu Organa has been kidnapped. I fail to see why this is important. Are you kidding? Lu Organa is vital to the whole alliance. This is clearly Ulgo's doing. The kidnappers were from their ally, House Rist. An Organa Terral alliance would be disastrous to Ulgo. They must have ordered Rist to kidnap Lu Organa to stop the alliance. So let's get an army together and attack Ulgo. No, we can't do that. The entire peace summit will collapse, and with it, our hopes for an alliance. But if you're able to rescue Lu Organa on House Terral's behalf, we can still prevent a battle and secure our alliance. Why can't you people ever help yourselves? I was under the impression you had agreed to help us. 
Rist's assassins are uncanny, and you'll be going right into their nest. Be careful, but hurry. We need to beat the Organa attack, or everything falls apart. Get up! Thank goodness. I thought they were going to kill me. House Tyrol sent you, didn't they? They called about an alliance. I, I was riding to meet them and... Well, thank goodness you're here. We should act now, as I see no point in delay. Shouldn't we stay and try to find out who's behind this? I was going to meet with House Tyrol to discuss the marriage alliance, when these assassins swooped in and knocked me off my Thranta. I woke up here. But were they trying to prevent the alliance? Who would want to do that? Neither the marriage nor the alliance matter to me, just getting to the summit. The summit? But maybe that's it. Because now that you mention it, as I lost consciousness, they were talking about Master Sidoni. But how could she be involved? It has to be a frame job. It must be. Stop making excuses for Master Sidoni. I'm not making excuses. Ugh. I'm sorry. My head, I still get these pains from the fall. I can't leave here until I know if Master Sidoni was involved. The kidnappers used to go into the other room to contact their employer. I'm sure we'll find a comm device there. We just need to see who they've been calling. I told you, I can't. Oh, Jedi, I appreciate your desire to help, and I will be sure to praise your zeal to Master Yuan. But I am extremely busy right now. I can't afford interruptions. Did you really think you'd get away with hiring House Riss to kidnap Lou Organa? I would be careful about making such outrageous accusations against a Jedi Master. Now, if you'll excuse me, Jedi, I have very important work to do. Wait, Master Sidoni! I don't understand. What was her frequency doing here? How much more proof do you need? That's why I need to get to the summit. But if that's true, then the summit... Delegates from all of Alderaan's houses. She could be planning something terrible. Please, I need to get out of this place. My head is killing me, and I keep looking over my shoulder expecting more assassins. I'll see that the Organa Taral Alliance is finalized, and that you get to the summit. Welcome back, Jedi. I owe you thanks. We haven't stood this proud since our house was young and building its first alliance with House Pantir. Thank you, Jedi. Just make me your delegate already. It's already been taken care of. Lu Organa and my daughter Fasha are getting acquainted as we speak. I spoke with the rest of House Tyrell, and the decision was unanimous. You are our new delegate. Congratulations! Goodness knows I've wasted enough valuable time getting to this point. I know it's been a hardship, but House Tyral is truly grateful. I have the packet the last delegate was supposed to use, but I don't understand its contents. Some coordinates and a data spike. It appears that you need to go to those coordinates and do something with the data spike? I just hope she's not planning any tricks. Just one moment, Jedi, if I may. We would like to ask one last thing. There will never be peace for House Tyral as long as House Ulgo exists. If you're able to use your influence as a Jedi to convince the summit to strip House Ulgo, ensure they never hold a title again, we'd show our gratitude. I'm sorry, but I have to do what's best for Alderaan. Please, Jedi. House Tyral has security now, but we still require justice. Good luck at the summit. I hope you find Master Sidoni well and that all goes smoothly.
manji to ti puna puna kabuk nuni snemo if i can't go past you i'll have to go through you monki atacha kapatonka chisa picha So here it is, laid bare before you, the irrefutable evidence. House Ald has been conspiring against House Organa for years, preying on their good trust. House Thule is the reason the Pantir heir was assassinated, and House Ulgo is merely a puppet of House Rist. Lies! All lies! There are holographic recordings, documents. You can't argue with hard evidence. We trusted you! How dare you! You will meet our armies on the field of battle! You started the party without me. Just keep quiet, Jedi. I do this for the good of the galaxy. On behalf of the Jedi Council, I order you to speak the truth to these people. The Jedi Council doesn't live as I do, immersed in strategy, in variables, and outcomes. I have calculated the future, and for the galaxy to have peace, there must be war on Alderaan. I will not be shaken from this course. The time for discourse is over. It doesn't matter. My work will live on. Again. I'm so sorry, Parkanis. I failed you. I tried to keep the darkness from coming, but I failed. I don't have time for this, Sidoni. No, you don't understand. Listen to me, please. It's my fault Parkanis died. Malachor III. I miscalculated. He had to be left behind. He died because of me. Pinnacar! My head! Please, I can't block out his voice any longer. You must kill me to silence him. I thought you'd never ask. Ah! Master Sidoni! Don't get weepy, Organa. She almost had us eating each other for dinner. I think I can safely speak for all present when I say that the summit applauds your efforts. Indeed. But I have to say, Jedi, I'm at a loss as to how to proceed from here. House Ulgo is the true root of all of Alderaan's problems. I move that they lose their land and titles and go into exile. What? This is an outrage. House Ulgo are kings by right. You are usurpers! Murderers! Order! Order! There has been a motion. All in favor? Aye. Aye. No! We won't stand for this. You will have to take our lands by force. The summit has spoken. This meeting is adjourned. Thank you again, Jedi. Jedi, I heard that a motion passed to strip Olgo of all his lands and titles once the wars ended. And it's all thanks to you. Ugo will get what they deserve. This has worked out better than I imagined it could. With Argana as an ally and Ulgo soon to be no more, House Tyrell may soon return to glory indeed. As promised, with the authority I possess, I proclaim you a Lord of Alderaan and award you these credits for your service to House Tyrell. Finally, I get some proper recognition. You've certainly earned it. You've done House Tyrell an invaluable service. I hope you will come visit us again.
Hala Morgana told me what happened at the summit. I'm sorry that Master Sidoni is dead. She begged for death, and I gave it to her. I see. So Master Sidoni lost hope in the end. I wish it had ended differently, but I'm sure you did what you felt was right. Alam also reports that while you were unable to prevent a war, you stopped Sidoni before the damage became irreparable. Commendable work, Jedi. Master Sidoni certainly didn't make it easy. This plague has such a devastating effect on even the most capable Jedi. Tell me, did you learn anything new about the Plague Master, Lord Vivacar? She told me he was in her head, influencing her actions. I see. Master Sidoni was the last of the Lost Masters, and yet Vivacar still eludes us. Return to us here on Tython immediately, and we will discuss what you have learned. Lord Vivacar cannot remain hidden forever.